Hello friends, welcome to DKBMS Electrical. Today I will talk about Airfield Ground Light Beans ATC Airport Traffic Control System. So first of all, what kind of light is installed in the airport runway? What is its function? What are the features given in that? So I have already made a video about the AGL system. If you have some knowledge about the AGL, then given the video of how the control system is done. If you want to see then definitely watch my first video about AGL system. So if you are visiting my channel for the first time, then subscribe my channel. Also turn on notifications. Here I make all the videos of fire alarm system access control, system, building, automation system, lighting controlling system and airport runway light control system and I am a technician, so I have practical knowledge, so you must subscribe to the channel. This way. There are many types of lights on the runway, but your show which is being shown on my screen. Today I will give you information about this runway light, so the first light is yours. Taxiway edge light is on number 1, and runway central line light is on number 2. Harpy light is at number 3. Approach light is at number 4. Runway end light is at number 5. Runway edge light is at number 6. Touchdown zone light is at number 7. Then at number 8 is runway edge light, then at number 9 is yours. Runway threshold identification light. Taxiway lights are installed on airport runways to provide guidance to aircraft while taxiing and to enhance safety. Taxiways are designated paths that aircraft use to move between the runway and the airport apron, where aircraft are parked, loaded, and unloaded. These lights serve several important functions. Guidance, taxiway lights help pilots identify the correct course when taxiing to the runway, especially during low visibility conditions such as night or adverse weather, for example, heavy rain, fog or snowfall. The lights are usually installed on the sides of the taxiway, illuminating the designated taxi path. Avoiding confusion, large airports may have multiple taxiways, intersections, and holding points. Taxiway lights play an important role in preventing pilots from accidentally entering the active runway or taking the wrong taxi route, thereby reducing the risk of a potential collision. Safety during low visibility. During low visibility conditions, such as fog or heavy rain, taxiway lights create a visual reference for pilots, allowing them to maintain situational awareness and follow the correct taxi route. Taxiway edge recognition. The lights also help define taxiway edges making it easier for pilots to see the boundaries and avoid accidentally drifting off course. Runway intrusion prevention. Runway intrusion occurs when an aircraft, vehicle, or person inadvertently enters an active runway without authorization. Taxiway lights, along with other signage and markings, are part of the airport's overall strategy to prevent such incidents. Pilot confidence. Taxiway lights contribute to the overall safety and efficiency of airport operations giving pilots more confidence when maneuvering on the ground. The configuration and color of taxiway lights may vary depending on airport layout and relevant regulations. The lights are usually powered by electricity and are designed to be visible from a distance, helping pilots maintain a clear path during taxi operations. What is the function of centerline light in airport runway? Centerline lights on an airport runway serve an essential function in guiding pilots during takeoff and landing. They are installed along the center line of the runway and fulfill the following roles. Precision guidance. Centerline lights provide precise guidance to pilots during takeoff and landing. By maintaining alignment with the centerline lights, pilots can ensure that the aircraft remains properly centered on the runway, reducing the risk of veering off course. Visibility enhancement. During low visibility conditions, such as fog, heavy rain, or darkness, centerline lights enhance the visibility of the runway centerline. This helps pilots maintain a straight and accurate path during takeoff and landing, reducing the chances of runway excursions. Depth perception. The alignment of centerline lights assists pilots in gauging the aircraft's position relative to the runway surface especially during the critical phases of landing flare and takeoff rotation. This visual reference aids in maintaining proper aircraft altitude and pitch. Situational awareness. 
centerline lights contribute to pilot situational awareness, helping them stay oriented with the runway environment and surroundings, even in adverse weather or nighttime conditions. Visual cues. The lights act as visual cues for pilots, complementing other navigational aids and instruments to ensure they maintain the desired alignment on the runway centerline. Reduced pilot workload by providing clear visual guidance. Centerline lights reduce the cognitive workload on pilots during takeoff and landing, allowing them to focus on other critical aspects of flight. Centerline lights are typically white and spaced at regular intervals along the centerline of the runway. In some airports, centerline lights may be augmented with additional lighting systems, such as touchdown zone lights and approach lighting, to further aid pilots during landing and approach phases. All these lighting elements work together to create a well-defined and safe visual path for aircraft operations on the runway. Precision Approach Path Indicator RP, is a visual aid installed alongside airport runways to assist pilots in maintaining the correct glide path during their approach for landing. The primary function of RP lights is to provide precise vertical guidance to the aircraft, ensuring a safe and accurate descent to the runway. Here's how PARPI lights work and their role in airport operations. 1. Vertical guidance. PARPI lights provide pilots with a clear visual indication of whether they are too high, too low, or on the correct glide path during their approach. The lights are arranged in a row, typically consisting of four light units, and are visible from a considerable distance away from the runway threshold. 2. Red and white light combination. Each PARPI unit emits a beam of light with a specific color combination. When the aircraft is on the correct glide path, the pilot will observe two white lights and two red lights. This indicates the aircraft is at the desired altitude and properly aligned for a safe landing. 3. Indicator of deviation. If the aircraft is too high on approach, more white lights than red lights will be visible. Conversely, if the aircraft is too low, more red lights than white lights will be visible. This clear visual feedback helps pilots make immediate adjustments to correct their approach angle and ensure they remain on the correct glide path. For standard glide path angle, the PARPI system is designed to provide a standard glide path angle of 3 degrees, which is the typical approach angle for most commercial runways. This angle allows for a stabilized and controlled descent, leading to a safe landing. Five, Consistency and reliability, RPI lights are calibrated and maintained to ensure their accuracy and reliability. Pilots can trust the RPI indications during their approach, knowing that the system is regularly checked for accuracy. 6. Use in various weather conditions, RPI lights are especially valuable during low visibility conditions, such as fog or heavy rain, when the pilot's ability to visually judge the correct approach angle may be compromised. Clear and intuitive light indications provide additional confidence and safety during challenging weather. In summary, the PARPI system is a crucial visual aid that assists pilots in maintaining the correct glide path during the final approach and landing phase. It enhances the safety and precision of landing operations, especially in adverse weather conditions, by providing clear and immediate feedback to the flight crew about their approach angle. What is the function of approach light in airport runway? The approach lighting system, commonly known as approach lights, is a crucial component of an airport's lighting infrastructure. It is installed at the beginning of the runway and extends outward to aid pilots during their final approach and landing. The main function of approach lights is to 1. Visual reference. Approach lights serve as a visual reference for pilots during their final approach to the runway. They are especially important during low visibility conditions, such as fog, rain, or darkness when the pilot's ability to see the runway and its surroundings may be limited. 2. Alignment guidance. The configuration and placement of the approach lights are designed to provide pilots with a precise alignment to the runway center line and the desired glide path angle. This alignment is critical to ensure a safe landing and to avoid runway excursions. 3. Glide path indication. Many approach lighting systems incorporate a vertical visual approach slope indicator, RC, or a precision approach path indicator, RP, to aid in maintaining the correct glide path during the approach. These indicators help pilots gauge if they are too high, too low, or on the correct glide path angle for landing. 4. Incremental brightness. 
approach lights are often arranged in a series of rows or bars. The lights become progressively brighter as the aircraft gets closer to the runway threshold. This incremental brightness helps pilots judge their height above the runway surface and assists in making smooth altitude adjustments during the approach. 5. Transition to runway environment. As the aircraft approaches the runway, the presence of approach lights indicates the proximity to the threshold. This helps pilots transition from their instrument approach to the visual phase for landing. 6. Runway recognition. Approach lights provide an early indication of the runway's location, enhancing situational awareness and aiding pilots in identifying the correct runway, especially in complex airport layouts. 7. Nighttime operations. Approach lights are particularly valuable during nighttime operations when the absence of visual references can make landings more challenging. The lights help pilots maintain spatial orientation and ensure a safe landing. It's important to note that different airports may have varying types and configurations of approach lighting systems, depending on the airport's size, category, and the prevailing weather conditions. These lights at different airports may have varying types and configurations of approach lighting systems, depending on the airport's size, category, and the prevailing weather conditions. These lighting systems are an integral part of the airport's overall infrastructure, contributing to the safety and efficiency of landing operations. What is the function of airport runway end lights? Chat GPT. Airport runway end lights, also known as runway end identifier lights, REIL, serve an essential function in increasing the visibility of the runway boundary to incoming aircraft. They are located near the threshold, the end of the runway, and perform the following roles. 1. Visual identification. The end light helps pilots visually identify the location of the runway threshold during their approach. This is especially important during low visibility conditions, such as fog, rain, or darkness, when the pilot's ability to see the runway environment may be limited. 2. Depth perception. By providing a visual reference at the threshold of the runway, final lights assist pilots in estimating the height of the aircraft above the runway surface during the landing approach. This depth perception is important for maintaining the proper descent angle for a safe landing. 3. Runway alignment. REIL helps pilots establish and maintain proper runway alignment during the final approach phase. They help ensure that the aircraft is properly aligned with the center line of the runway. 4. Nighttime operations. Tail lights are especially beneficial during night operations when the runway environment is mostly dark. They provide pilots with a clear visual indication of the runway's location and orientation, making nighttime landings safer and more accurate. 5. Supplemental approach lighting. Reels are often installed in conjunction with other approach lighting systems, such as a precision approach path indicator, RPI, or a visual approach slope indicator, RCI provide pilots with a wider range of vision during their approach and landing. Visual guidance can be provided. 6. Runway identification. For airports with parallel runways, end lights help pilots distinguish between different runways and ensure they are approaching the correct runway. It is important to note that runway end identifier lights are typically unidirectional and emit a high-intensity white strobe light. This strobe light is visually distinct from other runway lighting systems, making it easier for pilots to distinguish the runway boundary from other surrounding light sources. Overall, reels play a vital role in improving the safety and accuracy of aircraft landings by providing important visual cues to pilots during the approach phase, especially in challenging weather or night.